Celtic would solve worrying problem area by re-signing 26-year-old, currently out of contract. Matthews has reignited his form at Sunderland this season. Celtic's need for a right back is growing and growing, as Mikhail Lustig and Christian Gomboa's performances continue to decline. The right side of Brendan Rodgers' defence is a worrying problem position. Anthony Ralston failed to impress at Dundee United and remains on the sidelines at Celtic, while James Forrest has even been used on the right side of defence. Rodgers continues to place his faith in Lustig, while Gamboa acts as backup. But even if he does decide to keep on using Lustig and Gamboa, their future at the club remains in doubt. Indeed, both players are in the final years of their contracts. In short, a replacement is needed and Rodgers should look to sign a player that knows Celtic inside out to maintain their bid for 10 in a row. That should see him look towards Sunderland's out-of-contract right back Adam Matthews, who has come back out of the wilderness on Weir side to star from the right side of Jack Ross' defence. Joining Celtic in 2011 from Cardiff City for a nominal fee, Wales international Matthews clocked up 150 appearances in all competitions for the Hoops helping them win four Scottish Premiership titles. He left in the summer of 2015 to join Sunderland, but has has struggled in the North East. But under former Street Mirren manager Jack Ross, Matthews is beginning to find his best form again. Indeed, in 12 appearances this season, he has helped Sunderland keep five clean sheets as well as creating five goals for his side from the right flank. Now in the final months of his contract at Sunderland, he may be allowed to leave on the cheap in January in order to allow Sunderland to receive a fee for his services rather than seeing him leave for nothing in the summer. It should convince Celtic and Rodgers to pounce, forming a Celtic reunion.